these companies are going to interlace what they what they generate in AI, what they generate in software, chip making, and it's it's going to have a tremendous effect on robotics, both humanoid robotics, which I sent you guys an article this morning about um, the BMW factory in the United States uh, that builds X3s. They um, just decommission their uh, humanoid robots because they want to relaunch with the new version where they've solved many of the problems, but they've proven that you can use a humanoid robot, not just the arms that you know weld things and things like that, but you can actually have a humanoid robot that can go pick up a piece of sheet metal, drop it onto the table where that welding machine is, and within, you know, with high, high, high capability, uh, high success rates, 99 point something success, success rate of getting it exactly where it has to be within tolerance, 